surplus and shortage. Notice at the equilibrium price, the quantity demanded is equal to the quantity supplied at the equilibrium price in a perfectly competitive market. If the price goes too high, notice quantity demanded and quantity to supply do not equal. Or if the price goes too low, quantity demanded and quantity supply do not equal. They are equal at the equilibrium price. If the price goes too high in the market, then the quantity supplied goes up at that higher price, but the quantity demanded goes down because of that higher price. This creates then a surplus in the marketplace. Because of that surplus, if the markets are allowed to adjust, then what you'll see is the price will drop in the marketplace, the quantity supplied will go down at that lower price, but the quantity demanded will go up. At this price, there is still a surplus in the marketplace, but the surplus is smaller. If the market is allowed to adjust, then the price will go back to equilibrium, lowering the quantity supplied and increasing the quantity demanded. So they are back at equilibrium where quantity supplied is equal to quantity demanded. If the price goes down in the marketplace, then the quantity supplied will go down in the marketplace, and the quantity demanded at that lower price will go up in the marketplace, and this will cause now a shortage in the marketplace. The quantity demanded is greater than the quantity supplied. If the market is allowed to adjust then, what will happen is price will rise. As price rises, the quantity demanded goes down, the quantity supplied goes up, and you'll still end up with a shortage, but the shortage will be smaller. If the price is allowed to adjust then to the equilibrium price, the quantity demanded will go down, the quantity supplied will go up, and there will now no longer be a shortage in the marketplace.